Hey, thanks for being here for another video. Um, no forensics today, just a simple data recovery job on a tablet that came in the other day. It's a so old, old Samsung uh, T530. So st straightforward job. I'm gonna do ISP on it. Uh, I'm just gonna do. You've seen me do this many, many times. But before I start, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and comment on this video because it really helps me and the channel. Uh, helps with the algorithm. I have to say it in every video because people do forget. So I appreciate it. It only takes you a second to click the like and leave a comment. Also, you can tell me whatever you want to see next. I can probably do it. But you have to comment below, otherwise I won't know. So leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe if you're not already. Um, anyway, let's get to the video and, and see how the recovery job was done. Let me clip my microphone here. By the way, I got new microphone, new mic. Um, this time I'm recording directly to the camera. Uh, so maybe the sound will be better. Maybe no more clipping. The other micro is just crap. I was recording onto a smartphone and then I was taking it to editing software and I was editing it over at uh, Audition and it was just a lot of work. Then I had to sync the audio. I mean, syncing is easy, you just sync it uh, automatically with Premiere, but it was just pain in the ass. So. Let's see how this one works out. Hopefully it's recording the audio because if it isn't, that's gonna suck. It's really gonna suck. Um, I can't really see from here the audio levels on the camera. The camera's pretty far. I can't even reach it. Um, so I'm using a Canon remote to get it going. But anyway, anyway, let's get to this job. So uh, this tablet, as you saw at the beginning, it is not working. It's warming up. It was pulling at one amp, one amp at one point. Um, so let's crack it open. With the ISMO that I don't have here. Oh, there it is. So probably, first thing is, let's heat it up. I uh, haven't opened these in a long time. I, I, I haven't had these in a long time, actually. This is a very old tablet. This is probably uh, 2014 or whatever. Really don't want to crack the screen. I mean, the tablet is not working anyway, but... Why I cracked the screen? I got a two surfers coming two weeks ago. No, last week. Uh, one of them is going to be for the next video. And the other one, um, it's a Surface Pro, it's the, uh, Surface, sorry, a Surface RT, or not RT, it's the ARM one. It's not the old one, but it's the new, new, new one. That one is not responding at all. There's no voltage going through it, so I, I'm not sure what, um, what the issue is with that one, but. So a bit lockered, so even if I do recover it, it's gonna be a waste of time. So let's see where this thing was heating up at. Let's get the cable here again. I uh, clean up this mess here at least once a week, maybe other, every other week, and then within two days it's just a disaster. Fun times with ADHD, you just keep a mess everywhere. Can we plug in? We're getting um full amp oh it's fluctuating let's see where the heat is okay let this sit for a second oh by the way if um, you know if, if you really want to see what I'm up to definitely check out TikTok so I'm with 70,000 followers on TikTok and I'm I'm, I'm on there um, quite often except for the weekend yeah, there's heat on this side let's try the face trick ah one wow, of the coils making noise Listen. Yeah, you can hear it. One of the coils making noise. I don't have parts for this, so I'm not sure if that's gonna help me, knowing that the coil is damaged. Unless I find the identical coil. Yeah, you can see that one of the caps is burned out. There was definitely some heat here. Let's see if. Uh Let's, um, let's break this guy off and then see if that makes a difference. I don't think so. The cap is already damaged. 
Wow. So I left it on charge for a little bit, but it doesn't seem it's gonna come on. I mean, gave it more than enough time to uh, to turn on. I also tried rep replacing the cap, but I don't think it's gonna turn on. So you know what? We are gonna do ISP on this. I mean, soldering don't, won't be the problem. The problem is gonna be plugging this into uh, Easy J Tag when we're. Um, when I'm ready to read it, right? So let's um, let's get this connected. So if we didn't get a read on this chip, then um, definitely what's happening is the EMMC is dead. Um, okay, let me stop the recording and let's take it over to... Um, oh, I didn't record the soldering. Let's start the camera. Oh. Okay, well, you're gonna see me soldering from the top. I'm probably gonna just speed it up then. And here we go, ISP is going. I'm not gonna film the rest. You can see the chip is here detected and it's reading now. So yeah, I'm not gonna film the rest. The rest is uh, you know the usual stuff. It goes through um, it goes through UFAD and then I decoded using a physical analyzer and then just dump the data. But yeah, this is pretty much it. That is the job done. Simple job. I don't get these that often anymore, but I still do get them. Anyways, subscribe like comment on the video it really helps the algorithm on my channel and i'll see you in the next video